Tonight, President Trump makes two stops in Mississippi trying to help a, a controversial Senate candidate pull off a win in that state's special election tomorrow. The campaign between Republican Cindy Hyde-Smith and Democrat Mike Espy has been filled with some big questions about race in the Deep South. Hyde-Smith at one point joked about attending a public hanging and said that voter suppression was a, quote, great idea. NBC's Vaughn Hilliard is in Jackson, Mississippi for us this morning. What are you seeing in this, this last day before the election, Vaughn? This is going to be a huge hurdle, Craig, for the Democrat in this race, Mike Espy, in order to pull off a victory. Donald Trump is here today with a campaign rally in Tupelo, and then he takes Air Force One down to Gulfport in the southern part of the state. Cindy Hyde-Smith, the Republican, is relying on Republicans here in the state to turn out. Donald Trump won by 18 percentage points. The topic of conversation of race, I just want to point out here, Craig, that we've tried multiple times to have an earnest conversation with the campaign with Cindy Hyde-Smith about her past conversation. Comments, but they've had no interest. This was one of our exchanges with the Republican senator this weekend. Could you clarify and articulate what if it I was heard that you anybody's were feelings? For? If I heard anybody's feelings, you know, we're just staying on the issues that are on people's mind. Anytime I've said anything to somebody got offended, I want to apologize. Could you That's acknowledge what it was problem. that what what offended people? Could you acknowledge acknowledge you what have why the statement? Yeah. I well, we have, and, and we have, and they've for articulated for I us. Could have possibly said, Pam, could thank I, you. Oh, could I, I say Jefferson? Thank you. It's the issue, Craig, with this is that she has yet to uh, clarify or articulate what exactly she was apologizing for. And multiple times this weekend, she said that she was focusing on issues important to Mississippi voters. But I've got to tell you, I've talked to enough, enough Mississippi voters over the last week that this has been on the forefront of minds, particularly of African American voters, which make up one third of the electorate in the state. In order for Mike S to pull off a victory here tomorrow, Craig. Not only does he need high Democratic turnout, particularly in the African-American parts of this state, but also has to win about a quarter of white voters here, which is going to be a tall task just based off of our conversations around the state with these Republican voters that called out Cindy Hyde-Smith's comments as, uh, as, as distasteful and inappropriate, but said ultimately she is the Republican in this race who will support President Trump's agenda, and we should expect a, a spike here for her today with the president attending multiple media markets here today. Craig. Hey there, I'm Chris Hayes from MSNBC. Thanks for watching MSNBC on YouTube. If you want to keep up to date with the videos we're putting out, you can click subscribe just below me or click over on this list to see lots of other great videos.